New Flirt Variants KP2 and KP1.1 Spark Summer COVID Surge Warning COVID-19 forecasters have recently identified a new set of variants through wastewater surveillance. These variants, playfully yet ominously referred to as FLIRT, carry the potential to instigate a fresh wave of coronavirus infections. Welcome to Channel Health and Alerts. What makes FLIRT particularly alarming are the alterations in its spike protein, a crucial component that aids the SARS-CoV-2 virus in infiltrating, colonizing, and causing illness in the human body. Compounding this issue is the fact that only 22% of American adults have received the latest COVID vaccine. This low rate of vaccination, combined with a population that hasn't encountered the virus in a while, creates an environment ripe for reinfection. Data suggests that the latest booster shot is struggling to combat JN, one, the most prevalent variant, and its flirt derivatives, JN. One, a descendant of the Omicron variant, currently accounts for 95% of U.S. COVID cases. Given these circumstances, experts anticipate an upswing in COVID cases and hospitalizations this summer. So how can individuals protect themselves against this potential summer surge? The answer remains the same. Vaccinations. The CDC recommends that individuals over 65 or those who are immunocompromised should receive a second COVID booster shot four months after their last one. The expectation is that as the virus continues to evolve and immunity wanes, annual booster shots will become a necessity for the general population. In addition, the FDA has recently granted emergency use authorization for a new treatment, a monoclonal antibody called PEMGARDA. This preventative measure is particularly beneficial for those who are moderately to severely immunocompromised. Another significant reason for vaccination is the increasing risk of long COVID. According to a recent study in the Lancet Respiratory Medicine, vaccination can provide protection against long COVID, a chronic condition characterized by fatigue, brain fog, and heart and lung problems. While it remains uncertain whether this new variant will take hold, one thing is clear. COVID-19 is adept at spreading disease and evading immunity. Consequently, it's crucial to respect the virus and take it seriously because like it or not, it's here and it's still causing illness. In conclusion, the key points to remember are that new variants like FLIRT are emerging, and the best protection against them and the potential long-term effects of COVID-19 is vaccination. Remember, sharing knowledge is caring, stay safe and stay informed.